Good morning Phoenix! Welcome back to my channel. So today we will be doing a close-up review of Pop Mart's Bunny Happy Spring Festival. So I hope the Random Burrito has uploaded their or our unboxing video already. If not, please stay tuned. But this will be the close-up uh, review. So let's start with the this figure. She is a typical Chinese uh, woman, <laughs> and she is called Great Fortune. She's very cute. She's wearing the red chong sam with white and gold trimmings or linings or whatever you call that. And her hair accessories are very cute, and those bunny ears as well. Look at the white boots with the red ribbon detail. And those eyes, I really love those eyes. I forgot what they're called, but that's a Japanese style of drawing the eyes. Although that was uh, much more intricate than this one. If you know what that is, sound off down below. Alright, so next we have, this is Blooming Life. She is very, very cute. She translates well on camera. The yellows and orange are very, very vibrant. Uh, her color palette is just yellow, white, and... Eh, kind of an orange and then the red but and the gold actually but she looks very very cute on camera she's actually one of my favorites very simple but very cute and uh, elegant and I like the translucent parts and look at how different the translucent the translucence is on the headgear and the lantern they have different uh, transparencies so Pop Mart really loves to make those um, what do you call that texture differences look at the sheen on those on her belt and ribbon different from the matte of the dress and the hair that's how pop mart does it all right next up we have this is best wishes she's also a very cute figure and i really like the translucent cap and also that what's that she's holding is that a lamp of, or some of some sort on camera, she is very, very pretty. The oranges and greens are very vibrant. It contrasts well with her white um, uh, pants and then the flesh of her skin and face. So adorable. <laughs> and look at the detail of the hair at the back. That's how much Pop Mart pays attention to all the details. And those ombres are to die for. I've always loved their ombres and gradients. Amazing. Okay. Next up, we have one of my early favorites from the Glam Shots. I call her Snow White, <laughs> but she is actually called Fabulous Treasures. So there's my favorite color scheme, wa uh, blue, red, and yellow, the primary colors. And the huge, huge yellow bow, Chinese something. I don't think that's a bow, but that's a bow. It's used as a bow. And the translucent ruffled skirt. I think in real life that will be uh, some kind of tool and those cute ribbons on her the buns of her hair and the one the right the one on the right is topsy-turvy very very cute but what i've noticed on this line actually is that that's the first time that they have painting quality issues look at look at the white lines of her chong sam it's not very clean right look there i hope you can see that on camera let me zoom in Look at the neckline there. You can obviously see it. It's not the best. But it's not as worse as Funko. <laughs> Shade. Okay, let's move on. Next we have, this is Five Blessings. She is very, very cute. Look at those, is that a ribbon in her bunny ears? I'm really confused with, the, with these accessories, but they are really, really, really cute. She's just wearing, uh, she's all blue actually, the dress, the ribbons, the hair, and then just a pop of yellow on her, um, what do you call that, hair accessory or a fascinator, and then the yellow on the a tuss, a tassel on her top, and then that red uh, Chinese envelope. So she is still very, very, very cute. But I'm really seeing a lot of quality issues. Look at those. Let me zoom in. 
There, look at the base of the bunny ears and then the adhesive there near the the ribbon. But overall, it's still very, very, very uh, cute. Next, we have... This is Family Reunion and I'm just holding her because she won't stand on the rotator. Uh, must be some weight and balancing issues. But yes, she is one of my early favorites because of her headdress, her hair. I just see ice cream. And I like all the pastel colors, pink, blue, red, yellow, orange kind of, and then the black detail to tie it up with her dress. So I really, really, really like this. Yeah, it actually looks like a French maid, her black and white outfit. <laughs> All right, we have, this is Splendid Prospects. There. She's wearing one of the more traditional costumes as well, and then her headdress is uh, kind of resembles a dragon. So red, white, yellow, and then the the bunny ears are pink and white. Um, there are also paint issues on this. Look at the look at the base of the bunny ears there. Then look at her. What do you call that? Uh, yeah, there the the lining of the top. And then the button area but overall it's still very very cute next we have this is abundant harvest I specifically picked her because she is wearing a dragon on her head and I like the white yellow sky blue combination it's very soft very pastel very appealing to me and look at the dragon it's actually kind of a bunny or a dragon that's on top of her head and she is she has a coin on her mouth such a cutie and notice the sheen of her uh, the pearlescence of her white boots very cute and last but not the least and this has a backstory that you will see on the unboxing at, over at the random burrito, ch burrito channel I will not discuss it here, but you will definitely have to watch out for that. So this is Lotus and Fish. She has a fishtail on top of her head. Very cute, very pearlescent. The purple, the blues, the lavender, everything. It's a gradient. I really, really love ombre's and gradients. Look at her hair. It's res it resembles a fish. And then the shading of orange and yellow and kind of a pink. It reminds me of a pear. So amazing details. And then her pink kind of a fairy dress. And look at the translucence of the, the skirt. Um, yeah, it's very clear in the middle and then it, it, grad it gradients. I'm making it a verb. It uh, goes to a gradient of a darker pink. So I really, really like that detail. And she registers very, very well on camera. Amazing. Okay, let's gather them up. I hope I can put them together. Yeah, maybe except, uh, what do you call that? Family reunion. There, we have the first four. <laughs> Such a cute group. And then the second batch of cuties. My favorite is definitely the lotus and fish. Just because it, well, not just because it's a fish, but I really like all the color scheme and all the and her simplicity and elegance. All right, that's it. Thank you for watching till the end. And again, don't forget to look out for the or watch out for the unboxing over at the Random Burrito channel. And yes, this was our first box of Pop Mart bunnies. They definitely did not disappoint. Uh, personally, this is my first uh, bunny Pop Marts. And I really, really love them. They are tall, they are big, and they're worth your money. Alright, thank you for watching till the end. Stay safe and healthy. Bye, Phoenix!